everyone. It is Crystal with Pineapple Papers, and it is day 12 of Christie's Beautiful Life, 30 Days of Sketches, round 15. So today's beautiful uh, exclusive sketch comes from Darla Weber. So I will have her information linked down below. She is on YouTube as well as Instagram. Uh, so you can give her some love and uh, play along with this sketch and so she can see what you make. So this sketch is super fun and it calls for a large photo. It actually calls for an 8 by 10 So I went looking to see if I had any 8 by 10 uh, photos left and I don't. Uh, so I found my daughter's school pictures from this year and um, I bought a five by seven. So I'm going to use a five by seven, uh, instead of the eight by 10, but this is a perfect sketch for all of those eight by 10 photos that we used to buy with all of those school pictures. <laughs> like I, I don't know what I was thinking. Uh, I think I was thinking that I would give them to family, but I never did. I was a super slacker. So uh, but I do always try to document uh, it in the album. So at least one of them makes them into our album. So I am trying to use my How to Kill a Kit with Style for uh, this quarter because it is done this month. And I don't have a lot of 12 by 12 papers left. So I had this peacock paper, which honestly I thought I'm never going to use it but I really liked the colors of it. And I think peacocks are beautiful. And I think that my daughter is beautiful. And yes, I know that the pretty peacocks are the boys, but I don't think my son would totally be on board with uh, the fact that I used the peacock paper on his layout because I think he's beautiful. <laughs> so um, I did go in my stash and uh, from two different, uh, paper pads that I had, uh, that green piece is from a birthday paper pad. And then that gold paper, I have a paper pad that's just like gold and craft. And because her jewelry is gold, I thought, I thought that that gold, uh, worked really well and it was just going to make that picture pop. So, I am following it pretty well as far as the layout. Obviously, my sizing is a little bit different. Uh, my title is going to go over there to the right as well, uh, but it's not going to be as big. I added some journaling spots and a die cut piece that says she always stops to smell the roses. And then I added some fussy cut flowers from my kit as well as a couple of the puffy pieces one says from the heart and uh, the other one is just a floral so from the heart is going to be part of my title the other part of my title is going to be this uh, word love from the sticker sheet so my title is love from the heart and I pulled this gold wreath and I am going to cut it apart and use it basically as leaves instead of the wreath. So you can see me doing that there. I'm going to put it at the top cluster as well as kind of this bottom tidally cluster. I also got some tassels up at the top and uh, my last little charm uh, with the silhouette. And speaking of the silhouettes, I knew that I had these clear ones and I only have girls left. So I'm gonna put one up at the top as well. And then I'm gonna add just one clear word sticker that says one of a kind. And then I'm gonna add a couple of clear uh, black florals. So I'm going to put them in the clusters as well as this big long one at the bottom of her photo. Then I think that I have just one, I think I had one sticker left on 
uh, the other 12 by 12 sticker sheet that I had and it was this butterfly moth and I decided, yeah, that's okay. I'm going to put that on there. <laughs> um, I liked the black and white of it. Uh, it's definitely not my favorite and I think I don't really have issues with butterflies, but I like the bodies of the butterflies to just be all black. Like, like I don't like all the little lines in it. I think that's the part uh, that bothers me. So here is that butterfly that I'm trying to uh, get on and I'm going to end up putting it uh, down by the title right there. Nope, right there. <laughs> and I will take a piece of fun foam and just pop up one side of the wings. And I think that is going to do it for this layout. I don't, I don't think I add anything else. I guess just maybe, maybe another one of, of these cute little sprigs. So I will leave Darla's information down below so you can give her some love as well as the playlist for 30 days of sketches. And if you have any questions, please leave them down below. I love to chat with you. So that is going to do it for me today. Here is my final layout again. And remember to wear your crown. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye.